Hey guys, so before you get into the video, I just wanted to say that this video and the following video should have been uploaded a lot sooner than I thought. Um, so like a good couple of weeks ago. Um, but because of my laptop being broken, I was unable to kind of edit as quickly as I would have liked. Um, but yeah, that's all I really wanted to say. Um, so just so you know, what you're about to watch was from a good couple of weeks ago. And the video that I will be uploading a few days after this one um, should have been uploaded a, a few days ago. Um, but then I'll hopefully be all caught up on my videos. <laughs> but um, I hope you enjoy the video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. today and honestly please just um, ignore that um, I'm a little bit hungover um, this will be going because I thought I'd give you guys and yeah this is just a little water droplet that came onto my top so that'll probably dry by the end of this video well by the end of this clip um, but I thought I would give you guys a little update whilst I get ready so don't worry this is gonna go away um, I just thought I'd just get ready whilst I give you a chat. You haven't missed much. Um, life's been pretty um, repetitive recently. And there's just been a lot going on. My January was pretty much just uni deadlines. Um, so in my world, January didn't exist. January did not happen. Um, my new year started in February, basically. <laughs> um, so that happened. I also had to move back to uni because basically before Christmas, I came back home to, you know, be with the family for Christmas. And, you know, I was only meant to go back for a week and then come straight back to uni. However, that did all change due to the lockdown that got placed on the UK by Goral Boris um, and therefore uni students weren't allowed to come back um, unless you were doing specific courses. So my course was deemed not priority, love that, um, so it meant that I was not able to go home um, until Boris says so. So love that from Boris, um, but I came home, when did I come home? I think I came home um like end of jan beginning of feb so i've been here for about almost two months now um and within that time it's just been quite repetitive here um not really much has been happening i'm sure you've heard this on record on repeat all the time but this lockdown is just not the one it's much more boring much less motivating and i've had other things like I still probably have it, but um, I recently kind of have a rash that's kind of popped up all over my face, which is also kind of maybe not one of the camera, but I was like, you know what, I'm gonna come up here, rash or not, fully bare, you guys, and who cares anymore? <laughs> so there was that, um, a show I got was gonna be and got canceled. It's been, a, it's been a roller coaster, ladies. I got a new job though, that's very exciting. Um, with plans for after uni i kind of want to stay here um where i live now and um but move in with new people and um stay where i am for a year more um but in order to do that i will no longer be a uni student here so i do need to get another job in order to cover my rent um just priming right now um but yeah so in order to cover my rent, I needed to get another job, which I have done, so that's exciting. Me and my friend can now, and her friend can now all start looking at a house together and start putting down deposit and all that stuff, which is very exciting. And um, will probably be some good content for you guys. Um, moving into a new house with some amazing gals. Um, one of the girls you will be, one of the girls you will be seeing today in the video. Um, but I'll, I'll go, go more into detail on that in a bit. Um, but yeah, so life has just been a bit hectic, but not hectic. That's how I describe it. Yeah, hectic, but not hectic. That's about it, really. 
Um, but other than that, that's kind of like the life update and my multiple stupid excuses for not picking up the camera, basically. But all that being said, today um, I finally got my ish together and we're gonna film a video we are we are going to film a little old video for you guys i'm actually kind of excited um well not kind of i am um because today we're gonna we're gonna be having a bit of a um pamper relaxing baking kind of day but i'm gonna be doing it with my friend ella who have you guys seen before on the channel I don't think you guys have seen before on the channel. Ella might be making a little first time appearance. But um, but yeah, we're gonna be going around to Ella's and we're gonna just do a nice old walk if the weather gets ish, -ish together as well, which it doesn't look like it is, so that's fun. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna hopefully go for a walk, fingers crossed. But then I think we're gonna do some baking um kind of like skincare routine and just have a relaxing day watch some movies and just hang out really that's the gist of the day but um yeah. ryan little <laughs> <laughs> but before I forget, um, I wanted to say a quick shout out to one of my friends who also has a YouTube channel of her own, and that is my friend Matilda Andrews. She showed me some love in her previous video, she's just brought out a new video. Um, because I think she's doing weekly vlogs now, which is very, very exciting. But her name is Matilda Andrews. I don't know if you can see the screen. But you should go check out her channel. Um, she shows some love for mine, so I want to, you know, girl supporting girls. Um, yeah, please, if you're watching this, go over and check out her channel. Because um, she creates videos every week and has some really, like, interesting um, and exciting content. So, yeah, go check out her channel, at Matilda Andrews. Love you, gal. Right, so that is the makeup all done. Um, I'll probably do my hair off camera because I need to dry it and straighten it and all that jazz. Um, but thank you for watching this clip so far. Um, but now, um, I'm not sure what the next clip will be. Let's just be spontaneous and uh, find out. Okay, because you just look nice. <laughs> Hi guys. So, um, we just got back from the co-op. I did try to get a little clip of us in the co-op. Um, yeah, I don't know if I'll put it in, I'll be honest. <laughs> but we'll see. <laughs> it was a bit like, oh, here's the freezer. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome to the pizza aisle. Um, but we thought we'd give you a little... Um, hole. Hole. <laughs> of what we got while we were there so you can see but we've decided that we're going to make some rice crispy cakes um so we've got the ingredients here ella has very nicely laid out the little cupcake cases for us there thank you to alary for providing those. yes very true we've, we've stolen your um cupcake cases thank you Alary. i'll ask you. you later <laughs> <laughs> we'll check if that's all right <laughs> um yeah so we've got well, we tried to get Rice Krispies in the Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bit of a conundrum. Um, we tried to get normal Rice Krispies, but they ran out. So we went for the chocolate ones instead because we thought they're putting chocolate on it anyways. Exactly. Um, no harm in it. Yeah, exactly, no harm in it. And then we got one dark chocolate chocolate bar thing, and then two milk chocolate bars. 
And then we've got marshmallows for on top. Then we've got some unsalted butter and golden syrup. So, yeah. Nice and easy. Easy breezy. Easy breezy. And then they're going to be yummy yummy. They yeah. are. So, that's my ingredients. You need a mixing bowl. Do I have one of those? Uh -huh. <laughs> I think Larry does. <laughs> <laughs> Larry, can we use your mixing bowl? <laughs> oh, yes. Here we go. <laughs> so, I always forget about these little things. Oh, like, yeah. Perfect. <laughs> Face. Watch this face. <laughs> For five star Michelin star. Rose <laughs> <laughs> Krispy cake. Gordon Ramsay, watch out. Very, 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 very good number. Um, um, right, so what? Let me grab my iPads and I'll get the instructions. Okay. <laughs> Hello, copies. Start because I need to turn this off. So already, step one is put the chocolate in a heatproof bowl. <laughs> <laughs> right, well it's fine. <laughs> um, oh, it's Larry, your scales are broken. <laughs> Try and melt in the microwave and we'll see how it goes. And then I'm also going to try and measure out the butter and get that melting. How much is that butter in itself? So? Um, it really worked. Look at that. Can you see this, guys? Oh, see, it is working. Oh, it's very hot, actually. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Alright, I need one degree. I mean, I'm grams. I keep saying degree. <laughs> one degree. I need one degree of <laughs> This bowl is in one degree, let me tell you that. Got it for you. <laughs> Honestly, none of my stuff is good enough for these people. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. You said it, not me. <laughs> what happened here? <laughs> A Larry, that was a Larry. We've <laughs> got a bit of a situation. She tried to stab me one time. That <laughs> <laughs> jokes. Not bad. Or am I? No. <laughs> 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 Lemonal messaging. I can't get it on. Is this even on anymore? Yeah. I'm struggling. <laughs> So we've got the butter melt in there, chocolate's over there, <laughs> just chilling. And then we're gonna add, I don't, like, I don't like my hands on the camera, but we've got four <laughs> tablespoons of gold. I feel like it is gonna be thickened out by <laughs> the hype. That's yeah. a lot of. That is like a whole bowl of cereal. So do, I, do I just pour it, it in? Yeah, yeah. yeah. make more sense on it. Ooh, girl. And then I say you mix it with that wooden. Here, you take that while I. Yes, use I can this spray this off. To spray it. Doing it very awkwardly. Can we are. <laughs> I think it's you, mate. You're, you're just in the way. Alright. Switch. Here a bit more. There we go. That's fair. Oh, hello. That looks pretty sexy. Mm. <laughs> You're talking Great. about me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this old thing. This <laughs> old Just threw this on. Just today. Just for you. <laughs> Alright. That's actually good, you know. Yeah, yeah. I was worried it wouldn't yeah. be enough. I think, but if anything, it was. Yeah. <laughs> It's too much! <laughs> Alright then, game book. Oh. I don't think I put this in there. I don't think I put this in there. Oh, I 
next one on but I love how this is probably the easiest <laughs> you will ever <laughs> make. <laughs> it's the easiest recipe ever. <laughs> There's no oven, Literally, like, no cooking in my whatsoever. And there's like three ingredients. Literally. I reckon we put some marshmallows on top as well because yeah, now they've kind definitely. of gone like a brown part. Like the marshmallows don't really look like marshmallows. No, they don't. Really. <laughs> you know, it's fine. But it's that flavour. There. Right. So just... She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something that feeds her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something bad to feed her Whatever, we'll probably um we're gonna have a little camper and we'll show you all the goodies that we've got and everything and mm. yeah. So now we're gonna be doing kind of just like a little pamper evening, but before we start we thought we'd like show you all the products that we've got, um, so that we can kind of just then put a little time lapse on of you guys just watching us do our pamper evening because we wanna like watch a movie, mm. just relax really for the rest of the day. Then so we thought we'd start the process with like a hair mask. So we've both got our own hair masks. Um, I have the Garnier's Ultimate Blends um, Smoothing Hair Food with the Coconut and Macadamia. So that's what I expect. Very really nice. I've got this Argan Oil um, little hair mask. Um, I think you can get it from like TK Maxx. Like it's one of those ones, not like a drugstore. Mm. I don't actually know. I, th I think I stole this off my mum. <laughs> I think it's quite pricey. Um, it smells Tesco. You can get them from Tesco. <laughs> um, mm. Mm, wow. They do shampoo and conditioner as well. It's like proper organic. So if you like the organic, save the trees um, and the animals, yes. that's a good product to use. Which we approve. Yes, we do. Save the trees, save the animals. Then we thought before we do full on face masks, you want to do kind of some of the smaller stuff. So we've got um, things like. Um, under eye masks, um, yeah, Garnier. This is Beauty Formulas. Beauty these formulas. ones are the gel eye patches. Yes, and these are more paper. Yeah, like the tissue but mask. I think this one's gonna be better. But yeah, we'll see. That they, you've got like a good pack of what? Six. Six yeah, okay. only one pound from Savers. Bloody bargain. Yeah, and it says, help your eyes feel revived and refined. Which is what we want, so. <laughs> what we want. So yeah, we've got, we've got smaller things, we've got no strips. And I've got, got some of those lip hydrator things. Yeah, these are the T-Zone um, tea tree ones, on oh, which yes. those are. Those are good. Which I've had good for the skin. Um, I also brought some um, eyelash and brow growth serum, which is we're going to try and um, putting on our brow hairs. I think you meant to do it multiple times, but... We're gonna try it today anyways. Um, and I've got some little like spoolie brushes to spoolie. apply that. Um, and our actual face masks, full on yes. ones. You have the Garnier sheet Yeah, Garnier sheet masks. What does yours do? Um, mine's the pomegranate and hyaluronic acid one and this is the super hydrating and revitalizing. Nice. 
Mine is uh, super hydrating and anti-fatigue because I'm looking quite tired, you know, guys. So it's my fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. It's lavender and hydrochloric and <laughs> yeah, I love it. <laughs> pronounce those, no one. No one. Yeah. <laughs> Respect to anyone that can. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then we've also got like um, other masks. So we've got this Garnier um, anti-blackhead um, kind of peel off. This is a peel off one. Mm. Um, Our skin's gonna be like, whoa! Yeah, it's gonna be like, look at all this tension. <laughs> <laughs> I can't take it. Well, literally. Um, I also bought little hand cream. Oh, know? nice. I love a bit of This hand is cream. the Body Shop. I got it for Christmas. Um, it's the warm vanilla one. Mm. So, yeah. I've also got this Drops of Youth, which I would like you to try because it's really good for just... It's meant to, like, just kind of get rid of, like, any dead skin. skin, but it, like, works instantly. It's like one of, It's like a chemical scrub, basically. Okay. Nice. I think, anyway. Nice. Um, yeah, Should we do cool. that before everything else or after everything else? Good question. Because maybe Probably we get before. get rid of all of the dirt on our face. Yeah. You only need like the tiniest drop, and it's in and like on your problem areas, not the whole face. Because like, oh. do you know what I mean? But um, but if you have, I don't know if you have. Do you have dry skin or no? Yeah, I mean, I have like normal to dry skin. I don't yeah. really have oily skin. Because I get quite dry around. Uh, yeah. My yeah, nose area well, yeah. and. My Sometimes ears at the minute because of this yeah. rash I've got, but um, yeah. I, I also have the CeraVe cleanser that's in the bathroom, and that's mm. for normal to dry skin, and that literally just melts away any like impure things. Yeah, in as your you face. can see, I still need to take my makeup off, so I've got some of the Garnier cleansing water. Um, so I'll probably wrong. take that with, with cotton pads. Um, because I have been using like cleansing water more now, I, like it's been a while since I've used mm. face wipes. Yeah, I don't think I've used face wipes for mm. like. Because I used to really always uni. think like, oh, it's just a bottle; it won't last very long. So oh, that's why yeah. I always got wipes. I think it it lasts a lot longer than wipes, but isn't yeah. it? But yeah. yeah, since using this, maybe it's because I get like <laughs> massive bottle, <laughs> but it's so good. Um, I, I like, like the rose one. Oh, my mum is trying to FaceTime me. We'll be back in a minute. <laughs> to have our lunch. <laughs> so we're gonna have some pizza as we kind of roughly saw our searches earlier. Oh yeah, um, and I think, oh it only takes 10 minutes, eight to 10 minutes. And we're gonna do that in my yummy scrummy. And this is um, 15 minutes, so if we, Maybe put this in first. Let's let Tommy have a bottle of this. Yeah. Preheat this. Do you have like a baking tray or? Yeah, just there. Do you know my lips look fuller than before? They definitely look <laughs> no different. My skin does look a bit more like hydrated. Yeah, it's chewy. Oh, so yeah. Yeah. You see how mine's just so red? Like, I don't know how to get rid of my really red skin. I have this stuff that I bought from Inculus. Mm -hmm. Um, and, um, it's supposed to stop, like, the redness and, like, make your face, like, one colour. Yeah. Like, so, even at your skin tone. Yeah. You get rid of pigmentation and stuff. So. Sorry. Mm -hmm. The flavour <laughs> just popped out. It's like on the advert, you know, it's like, bursting the flavour. Yeah. And it's like um, in over the head when the raccoon opens the uh, Pringles and it's like <laughs> <laughs> all of this bit doesn't have any tomato sauce on, and it does like down here. So there's no crust here, but like it's huge like crust. if it was on a conveyor belt or something. The pizza's gone too far. Yeah, and then it's like missed <laughs> the edge. Yeah, literally. Where they put the sauce? I feel like maybe we should go back. 
and watch a bit more while this is happening and then come back in a couple of minutes we'll be done with an update we'll give you an update when the pizza's all cooked yeah yeah back in a bit so ignore how oily my skin looks, <laughs> but um, we've, the pizza just come out of the oven, we've got it here, and yeah. um, we're currently watching Kingsman, and we've got drinks as well, we've got a little J2O's, there she is. <laughs> passion fruit. <laughs> yes, the best. Um, yeah, so yeah, now we're just going to carry on watching Kingsman, and um, that pizza and garlic bread. That pizza and garlic bread. Cool. <laughs> Right, so we've just got had we finished our pizza, and now we're having dessert. So we're gonna try our little uh, rice krispie cakes. <laughs> they look good. They do. They smell Happy good. Happy with how they turned out. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> they taste like the rice krispie cake. <laughs> <laughs> They're really nice. Mmm. I think it tastes just as good with the cocoa pop. <laughs> yeah, I feel like it doesn't really make a difference, does it? Mm. They're nice and like light because they're uh, rice rather than like mm. a chocolate bun. <laughs> I feel like to make it even better, there should have been more golden syrup just mm. to have like a, a sweeter, sweeter yeah. taste. But I think you're right. But it's nice. I like the marshmallows in there as well. It's a nice, like, yeah. different texture. We could have done, like, a more rocky road. Yeah. Maybe next time. Yeah. Well, oh. I'd give them, like, a 8.5 out of 10. Mmm. I might even go as far to say 9 out of 10. Oh, uh -huh. no. To say it was a simple road. Actually, no. Because it was so simple. Mm. Maybe an A. <laughs> Would it get the Paul Hollywood handshake? I think so. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> <laughs> I think it would. I think we did um, pretty well. You do say so yourself? Yeah. Fabulous. Fabulous. Mm -hmm. Have a marshmallow. Oh. Lord knows that I've tried to. You said I was the only one. No one likes being like to. You made this mess and left me with the pieces. Now I wanna burn all the bridges between us.
embarrassed. <laughs> um, but we thought we'd just come on here. It's literally like night time now. <laughs> yeah, like we basically literally. <laughs> so we basically just spend the rest of the day. We, as you've seen from the previous clips, we did our hair mask and then we dried it all out and, and that kind of like completed our pamper day. And then we just spent the rest of the time just singing, chatting, chilling. Yeah, pretty much that's it. Um, but I'm probably gonna head home now because it's late. But so we say goodbye to Ella now and um, bye guys. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'll end the video when I get home. Now I'm up. I don't like the way you talk to me, saying you.